They own the tiebreaker against the San Antonio Spurs. Golden State, though, coming off a loss against Minnesota in their last meeting, a game in which they came out in that game poorly. Underway, it's Draymond Green running the show. Green with the left hand off glass. He's got two perimeter players and seven guys that go at either the four or five. So not that? only down talent in terms of shooting productivity, they go right to it. Jay Sean Tate with an interesting itinerant journey after going undrafted in 2019, then went down under to play in Australia, where coincidentally he played for Will Weaver, one of the assistant coaches. Tate to the corner. Olinick with the sidestep three. Brooks inside, whistle and a foul. foul. Played in the last 10 games for Coach Silas. Four of those have been starts. Averaging eight per Looney with a little room service that time on the dive. He can finish with either. If he gets his shoulders past you, he's got speed and athleticism going downhill. Looney missing the elbow jump shot. High and efficient offense in Dallas last year. Six point lead for the Rockets. Porter Jr. starting this game off a little bit cold. Houston in the midst of a 14 to 5 run. Poole off the handoff, got it to go off glass. Wow, Mark, <laughs> Steven Silas was definitely hoping that Steph Curry did not do that <laughs> in this game. Uh, but he did say that he's pleased with the way his team has been playing so far. His defense has been solid. Has been helping to make it, it tough, uh, tough on him and, get, and pressuring him to give the ball up. Uh, I did ask him, you know, what did he like specifically about the defense on Steph Curry? And he said, we've done a good job so far. That is your power forward slash center with a little in-out dribble. Come on now. That's the way the game's going. Draymond Green, an undersized five, hanging around after that dunk. Steph Curry with the push. Golden State trying to take the lead for the first time in a long time. Curry trying to do the honors and does and lets out. Gives them their first lead mark since 258 of the first period and they've got all the momentum right now. Bazemore settles for the three. Right back to step their their intuition their partnership is something else so unique wood battling underneath fouled. And what was a breakout third quarter from Steph Curry? Steph outscored them 23 to 12 by himself. Uh, his game enhanced by the presence simply of Clay. He becomes option number, you know, three or four. Clippers have to be careful, Mark. They are 43 and 21. They've lost two in a row. Denver at 42 and 21. They've won four in a row. Clippers have to be careful, Mark. They are 43 and 21. They've lost two in a row. Denver at 42 and 21. They've won four in a row. Clippers have to be careful, Mark. They are 43 and 21. They've lost two in a row. Denver at 42 and 21. They've won four in a row. Jordan Poole with a nice pocket pants. Looney had it blocked. I think Jason Tatum might have gotten himself a spot on the Olympic team. Did Call you, me crazy. <laughs> did you tweet that out? I saw somebody tweet yeah, that did. out. <laughs> that to me is the last piece for Jason because I've said in the past I don't necessarily think he's always gotten a friendly whistle. He's lean, 